right? Oh crap! Right before the cave, man, you had to, you had, you couldn't just give me the gratuity of getting there without running into one last freaking random battle. I hate these things. I really hate these eyeballs. These blue guys get to be so annoying all the time. Like I remember, like remember when I was talking about how Jack Long, when I was when we were playing this game as kids, we never actually beat it because we couldn't get past this whole big gauntlet of crap with all these eyeball things and oh, it was just such a pain in the ass. Because we were kids, our motor skills weren't fully developed. We didn't know what we were doing half the time. It's amazing we got as far as we did. It's amazing, rather. Can you please get up here so I can kill you? You're just gonna hang around down there. That's fine by me, I guess. Don't really need to kill you. you. Don't give that much experience, dude. Of course, as soon as I move on, he's got to be a jackass about it. All right. Uh, there we go. Wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. I'm cast life, actually. You gotta stay on top of your life here, because if you, if you're, if you're even relatively low on life, you can take a series of hits in a row, and it'll just kill you or knock you into a pit, which would, I guess, kill you too. But. Got another one of these scorpion guys. He's in a kind of a nasty location, too. If you just downward stab him like that, though, generally you can hit him because he'll open his eye at some point. It makes a really funny sound as you're grinding along the top of him, too. Oh, do I have enough magic? I do. Alright, but I don't have any more magic. That's great. Alright, at least I killed him. Alright. Uh, yeah, I, I thought so. I, pr I was pretty sure there was a blue guy in here. Right, the strategy for these guys is basically just jump over their projectiles and hit them. They're not that bad if you get this kind of big open area. It's just when they're in those, like, confined areas or near pits that they get to be a little bit of a pain and your palms start to, start to sweat as you fight them and everything. Like, like that guy over there when he's, like, close to that edge. That's just when you really don't want to have to bother with fighting him. But sometimes you just have to. You really can't avoid it sometimes. Can I please... I didn't think that guy was going to hit me. What the hell, man. Oh, crap. What am I doing? I really don't want to move on without killing this guy first. What? Oh, shoot. Can I actually get through here without dying? I will be amazed if I actually make it to the... to the, to the Great Palace without being dead when I get there. Because we still got this whole... We, oh, crap. I forgot about that guy. He's going to advance right on me. Alright, i got to be careful here. I'm not sure if these guys can throw two in a row like those red alligators we fought way back in Death Mountain. I'm pretty sure they can. And it, if they can, you really have to be... Oh, not this guy. I really hate the red guys. In my opinion, the red guys can be a little bit more annoying than even the blue guys sometimes. But if, you're keep, if you have a big open space like this, again, they're not that bad. At least the blue guys give you the right amount of experience, man. Jeez. Well, technically, no, they give you 200. They should give you 250, because the red guy should give you 200. Whatever. I actually made it. What do you know? I actually survived with this, such minimal experience. God, I love this music. By the way, this here, the start of this palace, this is the only checkpoint in the game. So if you get a game over in this palace, uh, you'll come back to here instead of all the way back to the start of the game. All right, I'm pretty much dead as soon as I set foot in this palace, so... Uh, there's, yeah, this is going to be exciting. Alright, this palace is a pretty big maze. I was planning on having a map open for this, but you know what? I think I'm just going to wing it. I'm not sure if I'll remember exactly which way to go. Crap, we got these guys to deal with now. That's right. God, these guys... This guy... These red ones, they're not so bad. They're still pain. This guy's still probably going to kill me. But, yeah, see, there you go. They're basically your... They're worse than Iron Knuckles. They're the tragically strong Iron Knuckles of this area. It's quite the pain in the ass, I gotta admit. And you'll see that they take a lot of hits too. And I'm just, I'm not, I'm not showing this off well at all. I, I really don't have a strategy for these guys as much as I hate to say that. Basically, you just got, kind of got to charge in there and hope to be able to jump with their fires at the right points. All right, right after that pillar down there, there's a pit there, so just watch out. Be sure that you don't fall. It's only bots down there, but. Uh, since the enemies are, they take a lot more hits here too, so even those bots are going to take a few hits if you fall down. Pretty sure we're going to head right here. I'm pretty sure it's left, right, right. For the first, like, three elevators, but that's all I can really remember in terms of elevators and stuff. Other than that, I'm just going off of what looks familiar to me. 
I didn't actually expect to finish this game in this recording, but it looks like I'm going to. We're almost up to an hour in the recording, too. Hopefully that doesn't mean it's going to start to desync or something stupid like that. Oh, no, not you again. I'm actually going to cast shield just to be even more sure of myself. Alright. I'm going to back off a little bit here. What really annoys me is that you can never tell... Oh, can I knock him down the elevator? That would be great. I'm not sure that I can. I can try. Oh, he did! What do you know? Oh, is there going to be anything there? I'm pretty sure there's not. Cause basically, if you if they're on like a one-block ledge like that, then they don't generally won't have anything in them. Oh, you have to head right here anyways. Well, color me stupid. Alright, yeah, you can stand here and, like, grind off of those Medusa heads if you want to. Which, they're so, they're yellow now, which is really weird. I'm pretty sure they don't act in a, any different way than the blue ones. It's, they're just yellow, which is, I don't know, I guess to match the color scheme of the palace or something. Just to show you that, hey, you're in this big new area, it's the final area, so be prepared to face creatures from your wildest nightmares. Man. You know, Super Metroid, incredible fun. Yeah, oh god, what the hell? Oh, yeah, I remember these guys. Okay, uh... Wait, I killed him? He, and he only... That's right, he only gives you 70 experience. I remember that vividly, because when I first killed one, I was like, what? Okay, generally, you actually want to run away from those guys and not try to kill them. I got really lucky. I don't think, think I took a hit against them. But, because if... Generally, he will kick your ass, because there's really no way to predict where, like, where he's going to jump or anything. So you just got to be ready for it. Alright, uh, I thought there was going to be something kind of cool here, but I guess not. And I guess I kind of lied, because there actually is going to be a red magic jar up in this one. Or, or not, there could be that too. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to fight him, you know what? I, I trust myself, I trust my instinct, even though I shouldn't. Why Why am I doing this? What the hell? Uh, dude, how did I kill him before? I, 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 I like downward stabbed in the middle of him, and that was so weird how I did that. Oh, this is great. Whoa, man, those guys are powerful. You're more powerful than I imagined. Okay, well, I guess that's why. I kind of got, I kind of got big-headed there and forgot why you're supposed to. <coughs> Excuse me. I probably, I'll probably cut out that cough. I don't know why you're not supposed to kill those guys. Oh man, Sinistar, look at this. <laughs> These really big bubbles that are so fun. They totally remind me of Sinistar. Does anyone remember Sinistar? I am Sinistar. Might have to clip that in or something. That old arcade game. Alright, um... I think it's right. This I seem to remember just going to the right most of the time here. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I'm gonna cast shield. Just to be safe. Dude, I said to be safe, and now I'm taking hits left and right. Yeah, you. these guys, even with level 8 attack, which I actually don't have right now, I think they take 6 hits still. I'm just gonna move. Yeah. So you gotta be pretty careful around those guys, because they take a long time to heal, and they can deal massive amounts of damage if you ain't careful. And these guys can be pain too, because you can't actually bro block their projectiles without uh, reflect, which I, and I don't feel like casting reflect for every single one of those. So no, thank you. I'm pretty sure I downward thrusted there at the right time, but I'll just go by what the game says, I guess. Alright, if I remember right, there's going to be something a little bit, uh, vicious coming up here in a second. Yeah, see, even those bots take three hits, which is insane. I'm pretty sure you want to be at least four blocks high here. because Yeah, because there's this guy, okay. This guy is a major pain. He's basically- cr What? No! Crap! Oh god. Okay, uh, shoot. Cast life, get through, just run, just run. If you haven't- if you don't kill him, he's- crap. It's just is gonna. This is really bad. Shit. Oh my god. How did I do that? What the hell did I just do? That is not. Never do that to me again, Link. God. That was my last life, too. I was really on edge. I'm pretty sure there's another one coming up here in a second, too. I'm gonna cast life just to be sure I survive. I, how did I do that? Man. What I said, you want to be four blocks high like this. Is he not going to appear? Okay, he's not there. Okay. Thank you. Man, 
The oh crap, what? D -d 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 oh, what? Wh Why am I surviving? I forgot that that bridge actually crumbled. Holy crap. Alright. I don't seem to remember that, though. Why don't I remember that? Well, I'm gonna keep going regardless. <laughs> Probably gonna be dead here in a second, but... Oh, maybe not. That wasn't that bad. Um... Yeah, I really don't remember this. I probably shouldn't be going forward, but you know what? I just gotta do what I gotta do, I guess. If I get lost, that's just the way things go. Oh yeah, we got the curtains here, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna have another Sinistar. Yup. Okay, this does look familiar all, fun, familiar all of a sudden. Sorry, my nose is still all congested a little bit. Oh crap. I don't have enough magic for shield either. I'm probably, I might be dead here. I very well might. I'm gonna wait for all that fire to go away. If I can. I guess I can't. And there's another Sinistar. What? Okay, um... Is there any way I can get some magic? Somehow? I'm pretty sure there's not. Crap, what am I gonna do here? Um... I guess I just gotta... kinda brave it and tr see if I can kill him. At least he doesn't, like, block my shots or anything, so that's something to be thankful for. Just gotta be careful for those ones that move like that. Because you never can tell when they're gonna hop at you. Oh, crap, no. I still, have, I still have quite a bit of life left, which is something to be thankful for. Once you get close to him like this, generally he's not as bad. Except when that happens. Alright, I'm gonna kill Sinistar first. I, got, I just have to, I'm sorry. <laughs> or otherwise he's gonna get right in my way and he's gonna be a real pain. Unless he kills me first. I never even thought of that. Because I'm right down to my low life here. I didn't trust myself to go any further over there or kill him right there. Because I thought the other guy would come in and smack my ass. Alright. No. What? What are you doing? Okay. I guess I'm killing him like this. That's fine by me as long as I kill him. Oh, jeez. I shouldn't be living here. Doesn't. Why is there another one? What? Why didn't he kill me too? <laughs> Holy crap. Is he just gonna keep respawning? I hope that's not the case. I hope this, there actually legitimately was another one there. And I just failed to see him before. Because if he respawns, like, good lord. Good lord, man. Good lord. Good. What are you doing? Stop throwing the moving ones! Thank you. Okay. Wow. I'm still alive. <laughs> What am I doing? I'm, I'm so dead. Any second, any second I'm dead. What the hell? Get out of my face. <laughs> I'm not ready for that. How am I going to do this? You know what? I don't know if this is going to cut off, but find out next time on Let's Play Zelda 2 The Adventure of Link. I'm just sweating way too much. Okay. See you guys next time.